Hello, my most amazing artist. Um, last week we learned how to print. We did these um, symmetrical owls where we painted half and then flipped this over and rubbed and when it came out it made this amazing symmetrical butterfly. Today what we're going to do, we're going to experiment a little bit with color and we're going to use some of these spaces in here to color. Now we're going to talk about you could color over some of your silver or blue or whatever color you used. These are metallic oil pastels, so they're shiny, similar to your paint. But because they're oil pastels, they're kind of smooth. So in each container, you're going to have two purple, silver, two silver, two gold, two purple, let's say two purple, two silver, two gold, two pink, and two blue, which is very similar to the colors that we used. So um, think about what and where you want to add color. Now the only thing that I want you to make sure you do, because when things are symmetrical, if you have this over here be gold and you color this gold, then this side needs to be gold. If this side is green here, then this side needs to be green because it needs to be symmetrical. So I'm going to take some of these out. We have purple, silver, gold, pink, purple, oops, I already got purple, green and blue, which I think these are the exact colors we used. All right. So you're going to share these, obviously, with your neighbors. Um, I'm going to start with pink just because I like pink, and I'm going to put pink in these little spots. And if I do that, where else do I have to put it? I have to do it uh, in these spots. Let me put this here. And you want to kind of press, not super hard, but harder than maybe a crayon, just a little bit harder. And you're just going to keep going around with your coloring. Sometimes I like to outline the shape first and then color it in. All right, first part of my owl is finished. And you're just going to continue with this however you want. You might decide you only want like three of these. You don't have to use all of them. Um, I definitely want to use pink. And I think I want to use purple. I'm going to give them purple eyes. you press I think it's better this is a little tricky because I have this fabric and it's not allowing me to press super hard on it So once you have everything filled in, then you can go back and you can layer colors on top of other colors. So if you want to add stripes somewhere, you could do that. You could put stripes along the edge of this. So if I want to take pink, I could do stripes coming out like this. But if I do it on this side, I also have to do it on this side. Um, I could do kind of some lines coming down. I think I'm going to do stripes coming out. But it's going to show up right on that silver. Be sure as soon as you finish a section that you go to the other side and do that same thing. So I want to do this on the same uh, on the other side, this exact same design. You can also, in addition to going over the paint, you can go over some of the oil pastels. Um, I think the lighter colors over the darker colors might be a little bit tricky, but um, 
I might try to take this silver and I'm going to try to put lines on my purple. Oh, that looks kind of cool. Oh, I didn't do that one. So now you just go back and have some fun adding some different um, designs. See how you want to do that.